Welcome on board of Paul Avant. We just completed the Senazer project, which consisted uh, of transporting and installing 80 wind turbines together with GE. And this was the first commercial wind farm in France. Today, countries are looking for uh, clean energy. That's why we need a change in the energy system. At sea, the winds are blowing harder and more continuous than on land. So that is why offshore wind farms are seen as the key to this energy transition. France has the second largest maritime area in the world, so they are taking this opportunity to build more offshore wind farms. This project consisted out of various scopes, so also various contractors were involved. Think about installing the foundations, installing the cables on the seabed, but also transporting the components to the Marshalling Harbour. Uh, we as Jan de Nul were responsible for installing the 80 wind turbines on top of the foundations in the offshore wind farm. Uh, we did face a few challenges, uh, but we don't shy away from them. For example, during the blade loadout, when we load the blades into the blade rack, we have to work with two cranes simultaneously. This is sometimes a bit difficult because it requires very good communication between the crane operators, uh, while actually the shore crane operator was French speaking and our main crane operator was English speaking. Once all components were loaded on board, we transported them to Bank de Guerande, that's about 12 kilometers from the coast. There another challenge could have been waiting for us because the seabed over there is rocky, which is difficult for a jacket. Luckily, one of our cutter dredgers prepared already the seabed, turning the rock into a gravel. And that is why the Volovan could safely jack up and install all 80 turbines. So after two years of preparation and five months of installation, we are now very happy to complete the project. We as Jan de Nul are very proud that we contributed to the very first commercial wind farm in France.